Hey everyone, uh, Salesforce Shorts here. In this video, we're just gonna talk about um, create, creating new contacts through Postman. So yeah, we've got, we've got pretty much like a whole series of how to get the access token and security token and set up all of this stuff. So if you're not sure how to do any of that, um, just subscribe and check out our channel and you can find all those videos there. Um, yeah, so basically what we're we gonna do is in one of our previous videos, we got all the accounts. Um, so we've got the um, URL here, we've got this stuff here. Then if you hit send, the send, but, send button, um, it'll give you all of the information about the account object, okay? But now what we're gonna try and do is we're gonna try and do a create, so do a post from Postman into our Salesforce, okay? So just a couple of important things. Um, in headers, make sure you've got content type and in authorization. Um, and in application forward slash JSON for the content type and in bearer space with your access token. Um, for, for your instance URL that you've got here in the beginning, make sure that's the instance URL you get from your access token, okay? So for example, if I go to my access token here, you can see there's the access token that we got, and this is the instance URL. Okay, so make sure you, that you use the same one in the beginning here. All right, so just back to the post. Um, yeah, if you wanted to create a new contact, all you need to do is just um, add four slash services, data, the version number, S objects, and then what kind of objects you wanna create. And then just make sure you've got the required fields that you need, okay? So for example, this one here, I'm just gonna call this, um, let's call this it, 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 con created from Postman. All right, so if we go to my contacts at the moment, uh, I've got 15 contacts here. So if I hit send, um, you can see we've got the ID here and success is true. So if I refresh this, then you can see, all right, cool, we've got our new latest contact there. And if you aren't sure about whether, let's say you've got a lot of contacts in your system and you're not sure whether it created or not, um, just open up any contact and then double click on the ID at the top and replace it with the ID that you've got from here and just hit enter. And that should take you straight to, straight to that contact. Right, sweet. Um, yeah, if you found this video helpful, please subscribe and check out our other videos. Thanks.